Hi, my name is Sam, and today we're going to go over how to register and merge two different data sets together. This is the second video in a two-part series. In the first video, we went over how to approximately align two parts of the same data set using the transform editor. If you don't know what that means or don't know how to do that, I suggest you check out that part before watching this video. So we're going to use this approximate alignment of the two parts of the chocolate bar data set as an initialization point for our register images module. So to first, we want to right click on chocolate bar model transformed and search for register images like so. And there we go. Next, we're going to make sure our model is set to chocolate bar part two dot transformed and our reference is set to chocolate bar part one dash reference. So the data set in the model port is the data set that will be moved to match the data sets in the reference port. So in this case, the orange part of the data set is the part that's going to be moved to match the gray part. There are four separate transform options you can choose from in the register images module. So these control how many degrees of freedom we allow the module to move the data set in the model port. So the register images module automatically aligns two data sets by the optimization of a quality function that measures how well the two data sets are aligned. So you can change the quality function right here and change it from normalized mutual information to another metric. So with that, we're just going to click apply and see how it works. Awesome. So it worked perfectly and we can see that the two data sets are now perfectly aligned. All right. So the next thing, if you don't want to pre-align using the transform editor, you can try pre-alignment using the align centers or align principal access methods. But for the best registration accuracy and for the module to work quicker, I suggest you try to approximately align your data sets originally using the transform editor. Because if you get a good approximate alignment, the register images module doesn't have to do as big a parameter search and is much more likely to succeed and produce a good registration. So now we are going to merge the two images together. So to do that, we're going to click on chocolate bar part one and search for merge, click enter. And we're going to choose lattice one to be chocolate bar part two. And we're going to click apply. Awesome. So let's see how well that worked. Let's connect the volume rendering to the merged object. So as you can see, we have a good merged version of the image. That is all for today. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great rest of your day.